Thank you, thank you very much. Excellencies, ladies and gentlemen, it's a very sad day for us as women in Kenya. It's very sad, and for women in Kenya, we have, we have a mixed feeling. I want to say women of Kenya are very ashamed of this nation. We are ashamed to be called mothers of a nation, so indisciplined of a nation that has displayed such disrespectful, distasteful language. You know these days we can't even watch television with our children. At Uskizi Radio, because Uskizi Radio, unamskia a whole minister. Akitusi, akiwachilia maneno kubwa kubwa. And you want to call upon this government, illegitimate as they are, to remember that we have our children that we are nurturing in our families. We are ashamed to be called women of Kenya today because we are ashamed to listen to our leaders. The disrespectful language that is going on in this country is soon raising a generation of children of Kenya who will be very shameless and we want to call upon the government, really, to call, to call, to call them to order. We want to call upon all of us to have what we call hygiene in politics. We want to call upon this nation to arise and become the nation that was left to us by our forefathers. Oh, how our forefathers are rolling in their graves. Marhemu Jomo Kenyatta. When he hears that a president can be congratulating police when they shoot our children. Shame on you, William Bruto. Shame on you once again. Women of Kenya are hurting. We are grieving. You have had a list of our children. Children who out of no fault of their own, all they did was going to ask the government that they are hungry. We want to ask William Bruto, what do you want us to tell our children? And we have nothing to give them. Over and above that, you have gone and started mocking our sufuria. And I want to congratulate the Honorable Kioni for being shameless about the sufuria. The sufuria is what unites our families as women. The sufuria is what feeds our children. These days, wanasema ati walitupatia fertilizer. We want to tell William Ruto and his government how to pull the fertilizer. You gave us fertilizer, but we had already fed our children with the seeds. Today he takes photographs in his big 1,000 acre shamba. Akituonyesha ye, maindi yake, imeiva. Sisi kwetu as women of Kenya, our children are still hungry. Our children, our sufurias are still empty. Stop mocking our sufuria. And lastly, to our sons, sons that we greatly, greatly love. Our son, Uhuru Boigai Kenyatta, Toto Wetu. Our son, Raila Molo Odinga, we love you. Our son, Kalonzo Usioka. Our son, Eugene Wamalwa, Mama Mada Karua. All our sons in leadership, women of Kenya, are calling for peace and reconciliation. We know that we have raised you well. We know that we have raised you to be fearless. Natunataka kuambia, do not stop. Keep the pressure going because our children are hungry. Watoto wetu wanatuuliza, hakuna school fees. Watoto wengine wanaenda shule, sisi, wanini tuko nyumbani. So for our sons, do not stop. We have raised you to be fearless. But at the same time, extend a hand of reconciliation because our children want a peaceful nation where they can grow. Our children want a nation where they can be fed. And we pray that the tears that the Kenyan mothers are crying today become a curse to William Ruto and his government. May all the tears of Kenyan women who are crying because of hungry children, because of children who have been killed, May William Ruto never find peace because of the curse of the tears of the women of Kenya. As I conclude, we were not given time to lay a wreath. Please give me just one minute, respectfully. I ask just a few women leaders, uh, women leaders from Makwe, 
Kiambo, please just come. Let us just lay read on behalf of the women of Kenya. We were not given that chance. Please just come forward. Just a few women. On behalf of women of Kenya, we have lost our children. We are grieving and we are in pain. May our fallen man, the man of heroes, rest in peace. I thank you very much. Asante sana, Meshimewa Daktari Caroline Karubu. Uh, as you proceed with the laying of the flowers and lighting of the candles, let me invite, let me invite Babu just for a short while.